Thank you guys for tuning in to Let's Chat with Denisha. You want to see how I achieve this look? Please stay tuned for more. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. This was a very inexpensive hairstyle. So I had two packs of braid and all I did was I took out um, two bundles. There you had it, two colors and I, so I wanted to go for like an ombre type of look and that's what I did. So what I did was um, the top of my hair, I just put it between those two braids and then um, to make the bang at the front, I just pull most of the braid to the back that I'll be putting in a bun make, making sure that it's the correct length that I have and then all I did was I just twist it around you know to make it into a nice neat bun <music> And there you have it so make sure that it is nicely tucked in and I just use regular bobby pins to um, get the bun secured and that's it now moving on to the front and as I said that I put the less amount of hair at the front just to make the bang and all I did was just to comb it down and then you're gonna see where I will be cutting it now um, to shape it After I finished shaping it, I realized that I never wanted to go for that tall and short look. So I just ended up cutting it off and you'll see that later on. So because this is regular braid extension, you have to put that hot iron or curling iron or whatever you want to call it. Put it on low heat because you don't want the temperature to be that high. It's going to burn the hair. Okay. So all I did was put it on the lowest and then I just curled to make the bang in the way that I wanted it to. Now this can be worn two ways. You can either sweep it to the side as you will see in the in the pictures or you can just wear it you know like the regular bang but I don't know. Um, I wore it this way but then <laughs> I don't think it fit me that well so I started wearing it um, to the side but you let me know which of these styles you prefer